Hello, welcome to all seven of us, and today we're going to be doing an update on Chantel's tomato bush. So, this is Chantel's tomato bush. If you watched the last video that we did a few weeks ago, or maybe a month ago, I think it was. Um, it was a lot smaller then. Yeah. So, there are quite a few tomatoes on it. So, here's one of them. They're getting quite big. Yeah. It's still there's, green. There's heaps over here. <sighs> can just see one hanging. There's another one behind it. So, this tomato plant is getting really big. And yeah, it's overflowing the, the wall. Yeah. So we're going to need to give it a bit of a trim and we're going to put these stakes in the ground properly. So straighten them up a little bit to try and hold the tomato plant up. So it's... we're not going to do that in this video because we don't have an extraordinary amount of time. There's even a spider on it. And look how tall it's getting. It's halfway up the fence. There's even a spider making this plant home. I don't know if you get guys can see it. Chantel will freak out when she sees it. <laughs> yeah, and it's got lots of flowers coming. It's nearly as tall as I am. Yeah, more flowers. So we're gonna, we're gonna try and straighten up all of these um, metal posts and put them into the ground properly to be a bit more supportive. And we'll probably get a proper twine or proper string on like this wool to actually hold it into place. It's done a good job. It has done a good job, but wool can only support so much weight before it snaps, but it has done a good job so far. So, how many even is there? I think there's six or seven, but they're just all so big, they're just kind of in one bush. So we'll give you an update next week and we'll be putting this into the, uh, we'll be fixing this up next week. Please like and subscribe and we'll see you in future videos and shorts.